Only on two works for you, teachers in Owasso get a much needed surprise after millions in cuts to education across the state. Two works for you anchor Max Resnick explains how the Owasso Education Foundation is making a difference this year. Here in Owasso, the public school system stares down budget shortfalls like school districts across the state. About $400,000 this year and maybe as much as $2.8 million next year. But for a moment today, the attention turned from cuts to grants. As many Bet Rich's jazz choir wraps up Evolution of Music by Pentatonix, she gets an answer to a question she's waited a month for. Congratulations. On behalf of the Wasso Education Foundation, we would like to present you with your check for your grants. That $1,400 check allows the jazz choir to take their talents outside the building and perform at community functions. We are not able to, to purchase things like that big ticket items for the kids without the help of organizations like OEF. In Mindy's 19 years of teaching, she can't recall a time when education funding was as constant a concern as it is now. This is the worst we've seen it. Down the hall, first year art teacher Kay Bratcher faces that same uphill battle, but she too is in for a surprise, a $1,200 professional development grant. Oh, I'm really excited. I'm taking some drawing classes. Um, all of it is online this summer. Um, it'll just help me propel my students into um, the next phase. Kay and Minnie are just two of the 10 stops for the Owasso Education Foundation Friday, giving out nearly $45,000 and nearly $95,000 overall for the school year. As for the Owasso Public Schools, the superintendent tells me that the goal for next year is to avoid teacher cuts, but there will be reductions in services as well as administration and support staff. With so much at stake, Dr. Clark Ogilvie says everything has to be on the table. In Owasso, Max Resnick, two works for you.